14 News Now, leading you into the future of how you get your news. Local, dependable, on demand. For News Now Warsaw, I'm Phil Kuhn. A Wabash County man was killed near Warsaw Saturday night when the motorcycle he was riding in hit a pickup truck that had allegedly pulled out in front of him. The Kosciuszko County Sheriff's Department says 51-year-old Jeff Gable of North Manchester was pronounced dead at the scene at the intersection of State Road 15 and County Road 350 South. The driver of the pickup has been identified as 49-year-old Kevin Bell of Winona Lake, who was not injured. His passenger, 59-year-old Vicki Hepler, also of Winona Lake, suffered chest pains and was taken to Kosciuszko Community Hospital in serious condition. A mental woman has pled guilty in Kosciuszko County for welfare fraud. 29-year-old Holly R. Clayball knowingly defrauded the system by collecting unemployment insurance benefits while working full-time. Clayball has been ordered to repay over $37,000 in restitution for the benefits she fraudulently collected and was also sentenced to four years of probation. The Department of Workforce Development receives wage reports and new hire data from Indiana employers documenting who's employed and receiving compensation. The agency uses this information to ensure people are not collecting unemployment insurance benefits while working. Your weather's coming up in 15 seconds. Get the vehicle you want at The Car Company in Warsaw. You'll find more makes, models, colors, and styles of high-quality pre-owned cars, trucks, vans, and SUVs at half the price of new. And now your new full-line Suzuki dealership for motorcycles, ATVs, and scooters. The Car Company on US 30 East in Warsaw. Looking at your Storm Team 16 forecast tonight, rain is likely with a low of 40. Tomorrow we'll see showers early in the day with highs in the mid-40s. And Wednesday, a mix of rain and snow is expected with a high of 38 degrees. Average retail gasoline prices in Indiana have risen 9.4 cents per gallon in the past week, but still only average $1.89 a gallon yesterday. That compares with the national average that has fallen 2.4 cents per gallon in the last week to $2.04 a gallon, according to GasBuddy.com. Prices yesterday were 88.7 cents per gallon lower than the same day one year ago and are 31.8 cents per gallon lower than just a month ago. From the newsroom, I'm Phil Kuhn. Have a great day.